It has now been five months or 150 days since I started my NoFap journey. In those 150 days, I have changed quite a bit. Anyone who's been following my channel throughout this whole time can see that. They can see that I've become more confident. I have more energy. I'm more consistent with YouTube. And you know, it's showing in my numbers. And you know, these are all very real benefits, okay? I like to keep things real. I'm not gonna sugarcoat things or you know, gas nofap up like it's gonna give you superpowers. And I mean, it might, you know, I can't speak for you or anyone else, but I can speak for myself and tell you what I've experienced in this time. So with that being said, the first benefit that I've experienced in these past five months is having more confidence. This is something that's kind of hard to quantify, especially on a day-by-day -day basis. I can't really tell you how much more confident I've gotten, but I can tell from watching some of my older videos that I project my voice a lot more, I make more eye contact with the camera, and that's a very big thing that I've noticed is that I make eye contact with people more, and it's getting to the point where you know, I make eye contact with people and they're the first ones to look away. And that was never the case before. I was always that person that would look down and, you know, look everywhere except for the person that I was talking to. And, you know, I feel like it's not really that important to be making eye contact with people um, as long as it doesn't detract from whatever interaction that you're taking place in. But, you know, for making YouTube videos, I think it's very important to you know, maintain a certain level of eye contact and project my voice and keep you guys engaged, basically. And I think it's shown in my watch time. You know, and I try to stay away from the analytics, but I've definitely noticed that my watch time has steadily increased over these past five months. And I think a big part of the reason why is because my on-camera presence has gotten a lot better. Part of that is probably because I just post so much more now that, you know, I'm just getting more used to being on camera. But even when I started NoFap, I had already been doing YouTube for like a year. So, you know, I was pretty comfortable on camera from the beginning. But, you know, this confidence, it shows with basically anyone that I interact with. Men, women, you know, just anyone. Like, for example, when I'm playing basketball and I'm playing basketball against men that are older or bigger than me, I'm not really intimidated like how I used to be. Now, as far as women goes... I haven't really talked to that many women over the course of these five months, if I'm being honest, but in the limited interactions that I did have with women, I definitely noticed that my confidence levels were a lot higher than they were before I started NoFap. And I think a big part of the reason why is because, you know, subconsciously when you do NoFap, you naturally want to talk to women more just because you're depriving your body of, you know, its number one biological desire but you know I've definitely noticed that when I talk to women I am just more comfortable being myself I don't feel like I have to put on a front for them now the next benefit that I've noticed on nofap is an increase in energy part of this may be because I've been sleeping more but I feel like in the past even when you know I would get my eight to nine hours of sleep I would still be kind of tired like I would just feel a little behind and I'd have that mental fog and grogginess and I wouldn't be able to complete my tasks in a very efficient way because of that. And so now, you know, me doing YouTube, I'm able to maintain this pace of five videos a week and two streams a week. Basically, I don't have any more off days. I haven't had an off day pretty much since I started NoFap and I am not really burnt out. You know, I figured out my schedule and I work every single day doing this, but maybe it's because I love doing it so much, but I don't get burnt out doing this anymore. Like, this is just very, very easy for me now. And I feel like I could do more, but, you know, I don't want to burn myself out because, you know, YouTube is a marathon, not a sprint. But I definitely have a lot of excess energy and... Like I said, I think it goes back to, you know, subconsciously, your body wants to reproduce with women and it wants to, you know, go out and talk to women and build your empire or whatever, all that extra stuff. And so 
if you don't do that, you know, if you're holding back in one of those areas, you're going to have a big reserve of energy. And this energy shows up in a lot of different areas. Like I said, with YouTube or with working out, playing basketball, I just have more energy about me. And when energy and confidence mix together, I think that that makes for a very good on-camera presence. And I just hold more weight in my life. I feel like I'm the main character in my life now, which to some people, maybe that's been the norm for their whole lives. But for me, that wasn't always the case. You know, there were times when I definitely felt like I was a side character in my own life, but that's no longer the case. I feel like I've taken control of my life now. And, you know, this is just the beginning. I feel like I'm gonna go very far in what I'm doing. Now, the next thing that I noticed on NoFap is that I am mentally stronger and I have more discipline. Now, that mental strength has shown up in a few different places. For one, I feel like I respond to hate comments a lot better. You know, when I first started to do numbers on YouTube, you know, to the point where I would receive hate at all, it really did bother me at first. And you know, that's probably normal, I feel like, it's kind of difficult sometimes to make that transition from not really being known to all of a sudden receiving hate. But I feel like, you know, because I'm more confident in myself and I feel like the main character, I don't really let hate comments get to me like how I used to. You know, I just see a hate comment, keep it moving. Because I know that for every hater, I have a thousand supporters. Another area where my mental strength and discipline have shown is with doing YouTube, like I said. You know, just staying consistent on my upload schedule. Five videos a week. If you're subscribed to my channel, you see my face in your feed every single day. And you know, this has been going on for months now. I just have a work schedule and I stick to it. Like, it's that simple. You know, and even with going to the gym or eating healthy, I'm just a lot more disciplined now. My standards for myself have gone up here now. I feel like my worst day now is better than my best day before I started NoFap. So, you know, I'm just on a completely different level. I truly feel like I've bossed up in that way. And, you know, discipline is very important if you wanna do anything big in life. Because when you lack motivation, and you know, it doesn't matter if you're on NoFap or whatever you do, there will be days when you lack motivation. When you lack motivation, Discipline has to take motivation's place and you have to keep it moving. Keep your focus on the vision, the bigger picture, what you're working towards and knowing that, you know, it's all going to pay off one day. Now, the next area where my discipline has really shown was with a girl. Now, I'm probably going to make a whole separate video about this because I don't want this video to be too long, but just know that I had two opportunities, golden opportunities, to lose my virginity, and I did not take them. I stuck to my principles, and I did not take them. And I guess you could technically say that I'm on retention now. You know, I never really classified myself as being on retention until those experiences happened, and I realized that, man, you know, I might actually be on retention. If I'm holding my seed after, you know, five months of doing this nofap stuff, and I finally have the chance to lose my virginity and I don't, I think that that says a lot about my discipline levels. And you know, the fact that I was able to get that close and not do it. And like I said, I'm gonna make a whole separate video about that because that's a story on its own. The next benefit that I've noticed on NoFap is I am more driven. Now, that kind of goes along with, you know, being disciplined being confident and having more energy, but I just generally have more motivation to stay on my purpose now. And, you know, it's getting to the point where if I don't stay on my purpose, I don't feel right. Like I feel bad on the inside. If, you know, I know I have a video to film or edit and I'm over here on social media, scrolling through my feed or doing some other nonsense that I know is completely unproductive towards my purpose, I feel terrible. And I feel like I'm wasting my time because more often than not, I am. So, you know, I feel like that has really helped me to just stay on my path 
and stay consistent with these videos. And you know, there was a little time when I feel like my motivation might have came from the wrong places. Like I was a little too focused on making money and getting views and things like that. But you know, I've gotten to a point now where I feel like I've centered myself out and found that balance that I need where my primary goal is to help as many people out as I possibly can. And I know that everything else will follow. And you know, ever since I made that change, made that shift in my paradigm, I've definitely noticed I have much more desire to film videos and to interact with my supporters. And you know, it feels amazing. Like I'm literally living my dreams right now. Even though I'm not making that much money, I'm still living my dreams because I'm getting paid to help people out on my own time. And the same goes with working out. You know, I've been very consistent with working out because I know that I want my body to be in the best shape I could possibly get it in. And you know, I'm not trying to be a bodybuilder or a professional athlete or anything like that, but at the end of the day, you only get one body, so you should take care of it. And I feel like, you know, having that self-respect, changing my perception of myself and seeing myself as the prize, basically. I want to treat myself in that way. I'm giving myself all of the love that I never gave myself growing up. The next thing that I've noticed on NoFap after five months is that I have more appreciation for the small things in life. Like, for example, I can look out of my window right now and I can just see a couple of trees. And sometimes I wake up and I look out my window and I just look at the trees for a few minutes. That's something that I never used to do before I started NoFap. Certain songs that I've been listening to for years before NoFap hit completely different now because I'm not spamming that dopamine rush from doing that pleasurable activity and getting that instant gratification. And I've definitely noticed a difference in just the very simple things in life. You know, taking a late night drive, listening to my favorite music, you know, getting a comment from somebody telling me that I'm helping them change their lives, you know, and these are the things that really should matter in life. But you know, from PMO and social media, a lot of us have lost touch with that because we feel like those are the ultimate pleasures in life. And they're not, I promise you they're not. If you get away from those two things, then you'll see it for yourself. Now, I feel like everything that I've listed before on this list has all culminated in my YouTube channel blossoming. Now, when I first started NoFap, I was at around 900 subscribers, I believe. I started NoFap back in April. And as of right now, it is the last day of September, September 30th, and I have 11,000 subscribers. So I need you guys to understand that since I started NoFap, I have gained like what 10,000 subscribers in that time and before that for that year before I started NoFap I had only gained 900 subs now yes you can say that my NoFap videos did play a big part in me getting the subscriber count that I have but if you look at all of my most viewed videos you know there are a lot of other videos mixed in there and I feel like NoFap giving me that extra energy and making me more disciplined and giving me that extra drive to stay on my purpose every single day has definitely played a big role in the growth that I've experienced and the growth that I will experience as I get further along in my YouTube journey. 